After several tried and failed attempts to redevelop the World Trade Center, Wednesday, the Fourth Circuit Court of Appeals cleared the way for a world-class hotel. A plan for seasons is on the way that includes a $360 million renovation. There's going to be the direct benefit of the jobs and the indirect jobs, but there's also going to be a harder to quantify but very real benefit of the brand and the image and having this beautiful building restored and lit up. There's no question the building has seen better days. The prime riverfront property has fallen into disrepair, but most recently the building has been at the center of a legal challenge over how the city awarded the 99-year lease for the project. One of the losing bidders sought an injunction to stop it from moving forward. That was rejected by the courts. A statement from the developers reads in part, quote, the Four Seasons development team remains absolutely committed to moving forward with this important job creation and economic development project, a project that could also mean millions for minority businesses throughout the region. The project has 35 percent DBE participation. Good news for the hundreds gathered at the annual Black Chamber of Commerce luncheon. One of the keynote speakers, State Senator Karen Carter-Peterson, says minority Owned businesses have to have a seat at the table when decisions are made. They can be quite powerful if they engage and they weigh in on the policies that are impacting their businesses. Reporting downtown, Gina Swanson, WDSU News.